I'm at Progressive CNC in Peterborough. They're model and mould makers for various industries. Just over a year ago, they bought a Sehos five axis machining centre. It's got a huge capacity, six metres by three metres. It's got a 24,000 RPM spindle, and they really are getting the best out of this machine. MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news, reviews, events, and special offers via video media. Jamie, you've got a Sahos machine here. When did you buy this? 18 months ago. And it looks like it's well used. Oh, yeah, every day. Yeah, and, and the type of work that you're doing on it, we're going to have a look around the workshop in a minute and see what you're doing. But do you use it to its full capacity? Oh, yeah, definitely, yeah. And the sorts of sizes of parts that you actually machine on here? Uh, that They range from, you know, it's full capacity, six metres, to, you know, quite small jobs. But then we... Uh, put multiple jobs on, you know, so we can get, you know, a better turnaround, make more money on the machine. So do you use the dual zones? Because I know there's a dual zone feature in here. Um, we don't use the dual zones, but, you know, it's never say we, we never will, you know. And in speaking to your colleague, I'm interested in the Y-axis. It gives you, and, and the rigidity of the machine, the fact that it's a bridge type construction means you've got plenty of rigidity, but you've also got a huge Y-axis. Does that enable you to make Let's say, for example, machine a car. You don't have to do it in lots of different bits. You can do it at one. Yeah, no, that's that's the benefit with the machine. We can actually machine a full car. Um, we don't have to break many jobs up. You know, we can stick them on in one. Um, so for customers, they're really you know keen for us to do that because it's the strength. It's more stable, less error. So it's uh, yeah, it's great to have that big wire. Yeah, I mean, and it, and it's an accurate machine. Do you also do? Uh, roughing as well as finishing on here. Yeah, yeah, we we do everything on it. You know, there's there's not anything I don't think it it can't you know can do. It's it's great because we looked at a previous installation where they tended to do the roughing somewhere else and then the finishing on here. But the type, what are the types of materials that you are machining or roughing and finishing? Uh, we 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 use soft materials. We use uh, Uriel, which is a polyurethane model board, and we use an epoxy board. We also cut MDF. We've cut cedar wood on it. So, you know, we, we've cut lots of different and it's, it's not struggled at all. 24-7? Yeah, yeah. We'd, we'd like more hours in the day if we could. And, and on that point then, Progressive CNC, you've you just moved into this uh, facility as well. So you're expanding. You're the managing director of the company. How long have you been going? Uh, we're coming up nearly eight years now. So it's, it's expanded nicely. And, and how was the company came about? How did, why did you find it? You're a young guy, obviously you wanted to run your own show. Yeah, the, the last place we worked, um, unfortunately, um, decided to close down. Um, and it had many different departments in it. We was on the machining department and our boss said, look, if you guys want to set up, you know, I'll give you a trial run. So we, uh, we had four month trial in our old place. He, he didn't charge us a penny. He, he said, you know, don't take your redundancy money and, you know, try it here. See if there's a, you know, a lot of work out there. And that's what we did. And you're not, met, you're not into metal cutting or you're starting to look at that? We are now, yeah. We, in, in this last month, we've, um, we've started cutting metal. Um, it's always something we've wanted to do. But with the, you know, soft materials, is such a, you know, massive demand for it. We, we kind of like haven't expanded into that, but we, we are now. Well, you're in a niche business. I mean, most of the places we go are predominantly metal cutting. So what market sectors are you machining for? Um, we're, we're in quite a lot of markets. We're uh, automotive, marine, leisure. Um, we've done a little bit of the MOD. Um, so, yeah, we're, we're touching on, you know, the main sectors. So very broad. Well, I wish you success for the next eight years. I hope it's as good as the uh, first eight years have been. Thanks, Jamie. No, thank you. For more videos, products and news, go to mtdcnc.com or follow MTD Online on Twitter.